YouTube, it's your girl Tiffany, and today I'm coming to do my 10-month update. Yes, I know you guys. I just did my 9 months. I was very late on my 9 months. But um, today is March the 8th, and on March the 6th, I made 10 months since I did, or since I did my big job. Yeah. So, yeah, it's been 10 months. Of course, I don't really have to do a lint check because I just did one on my previous video, on my 9-month update, which was pretty late again. And I'm sorry about that, but yeah. Um, what I wanted to just come and tell you guys is I really, um, realized, I think I realized why my hair hasn't been doing as good as it was in the past. Um, in the past, um, I used to really co-wash all the time. I made sure my hair is very, very, very moisturized all the time. Um, I stuck with, um, shea, Mo I mean, yeah, shea, shea butter. I don't use that. I haven't used that in I don't know how long. Um, I used to use vegetable glycerin all the time. I ran out of that, just never bought it anymore. Um, so I want to get back to what I used to use, which was, again, the shea butter, um, vegetable glycerin. Um, I still use the, um, Curl Enhancer Smoothie by Shea Moisture. Um, I used to use a conditioner by Giovanni called Tea Tree Triple Treat, I believe that's the name of it. It was a very, very good conditioner, and it was the one before they changed the formula, so I have not tried the new formula. But um, I'm going to go out and, and buy it again. I did see a little gift set um, and uh, TJ Maxx with uh, the shampoo and the conditioner. So I'm going to go buy that and try that out and, um, and see if it works just as good as the old formula. But yeah, you guys, I just have not been consistent with my hair. I cannot tell you when the last time I co-washed. I don't do it as often as I used to do. I used to do it at least twice a week before or at least once a week before and I just I have not done it I wash my hair maybe once a week or sometimes I'll even skip a week so I I know that cannot be as good as um it cannot be good but but my hair does be moisturized I don't I don't let it get dry but it's not I'm not just consistent like I was before and so that may be you know that's my fault so I'm going to get back on the ball on keep, and taking care of my hair and doing what I'm supposed to do for it to grow. Again, I am going to get some kinky twists done within the next couple of weeks. Um, I have not done it yet. Of course, i got to wait on some money <laughs> or wait on me to get some more money or extra money to do that. But um, it's, it's not a priority right now, so I haven't done it. But I want to get um, a protective style and I want to do some kinky twists. So... I'm going to get those done. Um, hopefully, I'll be able to keep them in longer than I did with my box braids. But, yeah, um, I want to keep those in. So Because the box braids did do really good for my hair. They did um, um, help my hair grow. And so I did do a little trim. Um, and, and hopefully, I can see some results from that. Because a lot of people say trimming your ends does help your hair, you know, grow. So we'll see. But yeah, you guys, that's all I came to tell y'all. It's been 10 months since I did my big chop. It'll be a year in a couple months, so I'm excited about that. So yeah, yay. Um, if anybody has any advice on what to do to help my hair that, you know, I don't do, that you do that may work for your hair, please let me know. Leave a comment below, leave me an email or something like that. Just let me know what you do, and it may, it may help me as well. So you guys... Just stick in there with me. I want to thank my um, new subscribers so much, and I want to thank my old subscribers for sticking in there with me. I know I have not been as consistent with my um, videos like I should and like I said I would, but thank you for sticking in there with me. And hey to all my new subscribers, welcome to my channel. So thank you guys so much for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Be blessed, you guys.